All right, let me let me show you step two or step three here for how to do this. Um, this is inserting a diagram, right? Now I'm assuming you already have diagrams and pictures or something like that. Uh, but if your pictures didn't um, get put into your your um, your web page, right? Then um, let me just show you where how you can put them in here. Like here's this lame diagram here. Let's um, you know let's let's put a better diagram in here. So. Uh, I like to use PowerPoint. Seems to be a really good thing to do diagrams in, um, and you can use you know you can you can use all the shapes and things like that to draw diagrams. Um, once you've drawn a diagram, uh, you can screenshot. Okay, um, and and on a PC you could use a snipping tool if you've got like Windows Seven and on. Um, if you don't have, if you've got XP, you can uh, hit the the print screen button on the keyboard. Uh, and paste it into Microsoft Paint, and then deselect the marquee selection, select the marquee selection, and then uh, select it and copy, and then paste into the Word document. Um, here I'm just going to uh, select all that stuff, get rid of it. Let's put some shapes in here. How about uh, rectangles? How about this? All right, how about no color, no fill? There we go. How about the line is not blue? Why does it default to blue? We just don't know, right? So there's this thing, and then I've got uh, I've got um, got to put the lines in there, you know. It's like, ooh, look at that, and okay, basic shapes. We need a circle on there, anyway. So so draw your diagram like that, and then on the Macintosh, anyway, um, you can select pictures uh, and and screenshot a part of the screen. By doing Shift, Control, Command, Shift, Control, Command, and then four. Notice how my cursor changes into like this wonderful little crosshairs, and then you can select that. The fake shutter sound that means that it's it's not saving it. This is the one that um, that actually um, puts it on the clipboard, and then you can just paste it. I did a Command V there, and I'm delete that one. And here's my picture. Maybe it's a little bit too big. And wow, that's weird software. Anyway, okay. So that is that is step three. Uh, you can scan it. You can insert it. There's a lot of things you can do. Okay. Um, I could also insert a picture here, right? So insert picture is just uh, go to the insert menu, uh, choose picture from a file, right? And then <laughs> desktop. Go to you. You have to go to your folder. Okay, so, so if you're inserting a picture that's not in your folder, don't do it. Okay, put it in the folder first and then insert it. So here I'm going to stick uh, the alien picture of me in there. This is quite a good picture. There you go. Hopefully you won't lose any sleep about that. All right, so there we go. All right, um, that's step three.